Today, we're going to sort of walk you through a little bit about the application process here at CU, how to pick PhD programs, and how to make your application as strong as possible. I think the most important thing in, in picking a PhD program is really finding an advisor that you can work well with. Working with your advisor will be the largest component of your PhD, and so making sure that you have a good research fit and personality-wise you get along is going to be very important. Uh, so I would recommend researching professors ahead of time and consider reaching out to professors to see if they're accepting students and then they may be able to uh, review your application, which could facilitate your admission into the program. Another thing to think about with PhD programs is the core requirements for the curriculum. The majority of the curriculum is entirely up to you and your committee, uh, which gives you a lot of flexibility in picking the curriculum and the program that works for you. For me, the reason to choose CU um, is that CU has a good mix of um, courses and professors in uh, fields such as um, algorithms, statistical models, and also um, data science. We have amazing faculty who do these uh, groundbreaking research in uh, machine learning, artificial intelligence, programming languages, human-computer interaction. Uh, we've got a variety of different professors that are affiliated with different institutions across campus, which gives students a lot of flexibility as they sort of navigate the PhD and pick a variety of different research topics that they can explore. When I visit here as a uh, potential student in the open house, uh, I feel that I get along well with uh, my cohort and also the professors. The computer science department is very inclusive about the graduate students, uh, especially the international students who come here. Uh, I came here as an international student and I have always felt welcomed. In addition, there's no better place to live than Boulder. Uh, you have convenient access to the mountains, many different national and state parks, and it has a sort of a small town college feel without while also having access to um, the big city of Denver. So in this next section, we'll talk a little bit about how to put together a strong application to PhD programs. So there are a few major components of the application that are important to think about. You have the statement of purpose, letters of recommendation, your CV, and then your transcripts. Let's start with letters of recommendation. Ideally, you want to have somebody write a letter of recommendation who knows about your potential to do research. So if you have any research experience as an undergrad or a master's student, anybody you worked with there would be a great uh, person to ask to provide a letter of recommendation. Another good option would be an employer that you've worked well with, or maybe an advisor for a club that you were involved in. The statement of purpose um, is like a little history of yourself. First and foremost, be sincere. And if possible, you can list up the names of professors you want to work with since the committee may direct your application to those professors. And ideally, you'll have read a couple of papers by potential advisors, and you can sort of craft your statement of purpose such that you're creating a, a broad research plan that indicates what are you interested in, what would you like to work on. For your CV, you can think of this as an extended resume. So you want to include any publications, maybe past projects you've worked on, uh, previous job experience, and there are many templates online that can help you craft your, your CV. During my master's, when I saw that all the research opportunities we have here, I decided that I should pursue for a PhD. Uh, yeah, so the process to convert from MS to the PhD uh, is just about finding the right advisor with whom your work is aligned. So it's not super difficult to transfer from a master's to a PhD. A lot of students do that every year, and I highly recommend the research going on in all the fields like AI, human-computer interaction, programming languages, all these fields are really good. Yeah, I've, I've really loved my time here at CU. Uh, it's been a great opportunity to learn a variety of different research topics, um, get involved in different organizations on campus, and um, experience all that nature has to offer. I'm really most appreciative of, of the staff and faculty here in the department that have helped make this such a good experience. So hopefully this video helps provide a little bit of background on how to put together a, a strong application and we sincerely hope you consider joining us here at the University of Colorado. Thank you.